I think. Yeah, that's all we needed. We have a jack, yeah, so we can get to the third floor now through the library. But I wanna go back and uh I wanna get the final, I think it's the final pouch. And it's also nice to uh you know complete the uh the little jewel thing. Uh, so we can now get the uh, the deagle. I call it a deagle. Um, so yeah, we have to do that. Let's let's not store that. Let's combine not combine store this. This and uh, and keep on to those. And prep this. Oh. We will then do this. There we go. So we got that, we got the jack. Okay, we're ready. I want to first get the, uh, get the little, um, pouch. I'm scared. Leave me alone. Good. Don't ever touch me again. Two zero three is the pouch one. The real one. We don't really need anything else. Now we're gonna head to the star's office. Even though the big guy is. It's honestly not that hard to lose. Hello? Oh, hi. Leave me alone. Oh no, we're going the wrong way. Stick the USB into here. We'll start the uh, the little thing here. Okay, good. 
now we have a little deagle. All I attempt to do is put this uh, first. There we go. Uh, we got three bullets. We need some more bullets. So let me show you this. That's it to the stars members. To my best of stars birds, how are you all doing in the travel station? Hanging in there against old irons, me. I just got back from a date with a hot chick. There you can guess what we got up to under her extra large umbrella. Europe is amazing, one month is in no way enough to even scratch the surface. Maybe I'll extend my vacation for another six months, Barry. Don't even think of coming to join me. Wouldn't want to make all the cute girls cr uh, cry, yeah? So you just leave the babe to me. Jill, if Claire tries to contact you, please let her know I'm okay. Chris Redfield, August 2019, uh, 29. Yeah, I can tell you for a fact that's not Chris. No, he doesn't even remotely sound like that. Pick that back up and uh... Gonna need another, another little locker, so... Oh, okay, okay. That was a, uh, that was a bad time. Why do you have to head in the direction I want to go? That's okay, what we'll do is we'll lose the board in uh, the other locker room. Because I want to you know, set up the ammo for uh, the devil now. Some outside. Yeah, it's this one. We want to put on this one. And I think we bought it up. Okay, I um, I may have put it on the wrong one. That's annoying. You guys coming? Put that away. Put that away. And now we want two of these. Combine those and uh, combine this. Alright, what I'm going to do is I'm going to... Oh. We'll do is I'll uh, cut this part out, because uh, it just takes a little bit and you don't really need to see it.
Okay, and I'm back from the car of a trusted eagle now. That was a good pistol. And now the uh, big guy. Yeah, he's gonna struggle to get in our way, you know. I think what I'll do is I'll put away the Matilda as well. Yeah, that way we got a lot more room. You are so annoying. No way. I absolutely hate it when they bang on the windows. It's just uh, one of those those things where you're in a train of thought and uh, you hear that. So I suppose I should go uh, second floor and uh, grab what's in the chest as well. Let me finish this uh, not this guy down. Yes, why not? Poor Marvin, wish he escaped, but uh, unfortunately not. That's what happens when you uh, hesitate. Okay, so this one is, uh, what is it? 6 to 11, gotcha. Okay, so it's for the Matilda. But uh, we won't be using the Matilda much now, so... I really think they buff this guy up a lot. He's, he's now... He now knows where I am all the time before. When I uh, first played. Yeah. I can't end. He, um, he wouldn't normally be drawn to me. Twenty-four. Why have I got? Since when did I get twenty-four? What? Flashbangs. I've got twenty-four flashbangs. What? I've got twenty-four bullets. I don't. Hang on. How did that happen? What? Okay then, I'll uh, I'll take it. Wait, what? Uh, you know what? Let's just discard it. I don't know how that's happened. Then again, flashbangs are more useful than uh. The regular way because uh, the regular way of healing because uh, you know one slot has three essentially three heals or second chances He's coming. Oh, I don't have a gear, damn it. Uh, you know what? We'll face this guy. Hello? Oh, okay. Oh. I um I completely forgot about that. 
<clears throat> I wasn't scared. Give me my gear. There we go. Oh, I may need to breathe a little bit. Let me use the green herb. So I am low. <laughs> you stay there. I don't like you. This really does one tap on. It's really handy. Is he coming? No, he's not. Pop in the gear. Entire plan police station west side clock tower. These are the high culture, cultural value of the bell. I'm calling a specialist in to make the repairs. We'll go over the details once they're on the scene. But in the meantime, I'll take steps to secure the valves that the yoke is threatening to break. Okay, so that's uh, the yoke's up there. Well, that's the... I don't know, I don't know bell stuff. I'm not a bell person. Back here, is that ammo? Oh no, there's one of those, those bingy ones. Well, that's just gunpowder versus the uh, extra large version. I mean, it looks to me like protein powder, but yeah. I was always so terrified of the fact that this was a dead end and uh. The big guy could come in here any second. I kind of wish they made that happen because uh, it would be more terrifying. But he can't actually come in this room for some reason. I don't know. I feel like his um, like his entrance was a bit, you know, uh, bland. And I kind of feel like they just, they, you know, you had an opportunity here to make me run down that way. I suppose maybe that's why they did it. And then they thought maybe, you know, let's stop. Because uh, that hallway serves no purpose but uh, to grab a raccoon right now. But maybe, maybe they changed it, I don't know. Well, I, uh, I don't really think you're gonna have to do much after this. I don't even think you have a job. And this is all over. Oh, hi. Hello. I can't believe he's bulletproof. Like, look at that. Completely bulletproof. You know, you've solved a lot of problems in this world by uh, giving him that, but uh, it's unfortunate. I don't even know why they didn't put it on Nemesis, because uh, it looks like his uh, clothing is uh, breakable. Now, for those of you who don't know, Nemesis is uh, the bad guy for uh, the next game after this. Which is supposed to be very promising, but uh, I'll see when I do it very soon. 
I am heading down. Where am I going? Uh, I remember we're going all the way down the um, normal route. And I'll pick up the cube on the way. We have two cubes. Down this way, and oh well, I guess I um okay, maybe I did put it on the right window. I don't ever recall two zombies coming through that window. I'll be honest. There we go, and uh, put this away. And we want to grab some. We'll grab some, you know, some help. We'll combine those two. The dongle we don't need yet. Uh, first aid spray yet. Yeah. And two green herbs. I'm sure we'll find something to make some with on the way down. Is it just me or do you guys also get creeped up by uh, garages late at night just on your own? Sometimes I'm just uh, going to the city centre's mall and uh, you know I just I go to the car park after a long shopping trip and uh, it's something about a, a car park that just creeps me out a little bit. Yeah, a little bit, nothing too big. Yep, quick, I can do this. That's nothing. So, um... Let me try. Nope, that has to go that way. Okay. Yep. There we go. Puzzles in these games are never too difficult. Then again, I don't find many too uh, hard. And Momo, the station swarming with monsters. Even here, I can hear the cries. But it's not the zombies I'm afraid of. Code named Tyrant. That's the big guy. The ultimate bioweapon developed by those uh, beep in the utmost secrecy to think that that thing might be wandering around here. Chances are they've ordered it to wipe out the witnesses, which is, yeah, that's uh, effectively what they've done. Okay, yeah, so that's just uh, an overview of that conversation they had. What are they after? 
And yeah, like I said uh, in the first part, the uh, the classic way this game goes is uh, you have you know the horror scene, then you you eventually figure some things out. You follow the lead you have, and uh, it leads you to an underground lab, which is where all the virus starts. down for the count we can go either way really oh my god okay oh okay damn you oh that scared the hell of me and it's a good thing I killed that guy there because uh, that could be really bad Keeping score. Look, this isn't a game. Nothing dies down here. I take it you have the key card. Yeah, and this. I was hoping you could explain what's on it. Maybe. Right here. Let's get out of here. We might want to open the shutter. All right, all right, Miss Sarcastic. You're so bossy. So, uh, he's gone. I'm pretty sure. He's definitely gone. Until you needed? Unfortunately, no. Ben didn't come through. Well, what exactly are you looking for? More info on the people responsible for this mess. What about you? Trying to save the world? I told Lieutenant Brenna I'd bring help. Good luck getting that. Yeah, you know, these are some massive works. I've never seen anything like this. Roads out. Going through that gun shop looks like the only way. I've, uh, you know, I've lived in the city center, but I've, you know, I've never seen construction like this on this level. Maybe it's more common in America. I don't know. Well, this place got raided. Something for our shotgun. Now it looks more like a shotgun, which is nice. There's a tour shopkeeper. Kendo, okay. Seems like you've got your reason for staying put, so I'll trust you to take care of yourself. 
Still, if things get worse and your other arrangements don't work out, you know where to find me. I'll do everything I can. Jill Valentine. So Jill has come through here. She's actually a friend of uh, Kendo's. I said, don't move. I'm just passing through. I'm gonna ask you to lower that weapon. I kill you are. You're gonna turn around and go right back out the way you came in. I think your daughter needs help, sir. Don't tell me how to deal with my daughter. Drop it. Don't wait. Step aside. We need to terminate her before she turns. Terminate. Fucking daughter. Ada. Just let them be. Emma? Sweetheart, I told you to stay put. Daddy. Yeah, daddy's here. Okay. Those fucking things outside. they did to us. You're a cop. You're supposed to know something. How did this happen? Huh? She was our sweet little angel. Mommy. I was sleeping, honey. Okay. And I'm gonna... You to bed too, okay? Emma. Just go. Just give us some privacy. It's one thing to keep the truth from me, but why him? I want to find out what's happening here and stop whoever's behind it. Helping people like them? That's why I joined the force. My mission is to take down Umbrella's entire operation. May not make it out. Whatever it takes to save this city, count me in. Quite a uh, sad scene there. If you don't know, Kendall owns a gun shop. Um, his wife got bit, his daughter got bit, he's put down his wife. And uh, I'm pretty sure that gun shot just to uh, put his door to a uh, stake as well. And I think afterwards he commits suicide as well, or uh, whatever happens at the end of this game, um, you know, gets him killed. Uh, the Umbrella Corporation? No. They're a pharmaceutical company secretly making bioweapons. They have a virus. It turns people into indestructible monsters. That explains the horrible things I've seen. And it works really fast, you know, this is the fastest virus I've seen, and you know, I've never seen the zombies get back up. And that's why I'm looking for Annette Birkin. She's the one at Umbrella responsible for unleashing the virus. I'm going to bring her down. I think you mean you're gonna let me do all the work and take credit for it. But I have to say I love the um you know how everything's done. Based on what you've said, the sewer seems fitting. Well said. After you. Gee, thanks. 
the graphics are really good, the story is really good. It's one of the best games I've played in a, uh, a long time. Can't imagine a real scientist being down here. According to HQ, this leads right into Umbrella's secret facility. Come on. Sewers are run by the city. How could they have a facility without the authorities knowing? Welcome to corporate America. Umbrella's controlled Raccoon City for years. Umbrella goes back a long way, apparently, in, uh, you know, as far back as in the, the old ages. Oh, Jesus. okay. That an earthquake? I sure as hell hope so. I don't. Just wanna see. Okay, don't need that. Goodness. So we want to drop some heads off, we want to drop this off. One of these. And then we'll keep some of these to mix and uh, I'll save here. Okay guys, I think I'm gonna leave it there. Uh, once again, hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in uh, part 3.